What's going on guys? I'm at a creek. I used to fish all the time. I'm going after bullheads and I've actually already caught nine. I haven't even been here an hour yet. And it's literally not even taking me uh, two, three minutes to catch a bullhead out of here. So what I'm using for cut bait is creek chub and I'm going to set the hook down and get it hooked up real quick. Okay, so when I'm fishing for bullheads, this is how I like to hook the bait. Just straight through the front, out the back. I'm just fishing right off the ledge here. And I actually stood up because I'm using cut bait. I was using live bait earlier. And a live bait just wasn't doing it for him. And as you guys can see, I've got fish down there eating the bait. Uh, it's really annoying. But I don't know if you can even see it. Yeah, look, watch. You, you can see the fish just tearing out of here. But uh, that's, that's why I like using bigger bigger chunks of... Uh, that's on the damn ledge. Fuck. Ugh. Uh, we're just gonna drop it right here in front of me straight. We're gonna drop it right there. And it's gonna sink. I'm just gonna stand here and hold the rod. And when I bull when I bullhead fish and I'm on a time schedule, this is how I like to fish for them. That way whenever they start to take the bait, I don't have to worry about the line, it just does this for me. So it shouldn't take very long, just a few minutes. There we go, there we go. Look, look, look the line's going out. Now it could be a bullhead, it could be another fish. The green sunfish in here are ravenous. I'm going to tell you right now, it's much, much darker than it looks in camera. There we go, there we go, there we go. See it going out? Oh no. Now since it's starting to get dark, these bullheads are coming out and nobody comes down here fishing. The only trails that are down here anymore are from, uh, from animals, they're game trails. I'll be heading home here pretty soon. I figured I'd try to catch one more bullhead before I made the video. I actually had one get off. Uh, a couple of them had just gotten off. But it's dark. I've got mosquitoes all over me. And uh, yeah, this might not be. Oh, whoop, whoop, whoop. Is that me? Yeah, it was me. Oh, we have a fish on. Fish on, guys. Fish on. Holy crap. Look at the rod. Yep, so that little drag I felt was a bullhead. Told you it doesn't take very long. Oh, that's a good one. There we go. Here's a little fella. He's uh, he's not too good actually. He's a little little greedy heathen right here. And sadly, I didn't bring pliers with me, so I just have to cut the line since he took it as deeply as he did. And I might try to I might read uh, rebait up, rehook up, regear up, and get one. As you see, they're fat in here. They have no predators. Nobody fishes down here for them. <laughs> And back when this was all trees and no grass, everybody would come down here, but I haven't been here in like over a year. So these guys are definitely, definitely stocked in here. Okay guys, so hang on. Final view of her, she's shitting all over me. Uh, pretty little girl, I don't know if she's fat or just pregnant, but we're going to get a release. And sadly, I'm a couple feet off the water, so I just have to try to aim out there for him. But uh, I'm going to try to catch one more and then I'm going to get going because it's getting dark. And... Uh, when the streetlights start coming on, that's when the dumbasses come out, so I don't want to have to fucking cut nobody tonight. Even if they don't die, they're going to wish they were dead. That's a nasty knife. That's my bait knife. So, I'm going to get off here and see y'all later. So, like, comment, and subscribe for more beautiful fishing videos, and I will see you dudes next time. So, I'm going to try to give you a part two. Uh, I've actually missed like four fish, four little cats right here off the lip. Uh, I'm just going to drop it right out here. I'm just going to close my bail, and I'm just going to reel the line in until I feel weight, which there's weight, so. There's a bite. There's a bite. There's a bite. There's a bite. All right, look at that. Fish on. That's what's getting me. Hang on. That's what's getting me. These little bitty guys are out in force. It's in his bone plate. This is going to be a fun one. This is why I'm glad I brought the knife. I'm actually use the knife as like a pair of pliers. 
in final view of the little micro guy and he's back beautiful so all the little bullheads are out so i'm just having fun uh, the tanks are out with them but these little guys are a lot fun too it's a big old piece of bait so once it hits the bottom we're just going to pull the rod over like this and we're just going to watch it there's the bite there's the bite Catfish. Once again, another little bitty fella. Now I'm using a creek chub head here rather than the body because that's what I have. That's what I decided to uh, put on. And uh, they're all getting hooked in the corner of the mouth this way. And uh, whenever I hook a creek chub and I'm using the head of anything, I always put the hook through the head. Another final view of the little guy. Absolutely stunning little bullhead. Beautiful. Let's see if we can't catch a couple more because I don't know where my ride is, but it's getting dark.